Hi, I'm Yasmin Voraji from yasminvoraji.com and the creator of Find Your Inner CEO, where I help you to create a new way of working in your business that means you're more creative, more productive, more fulfilled and more profitable. And the question I have for you in today's video is around the language that we use. So my question for you today is, is your small business keeping you small? So what do I mean by that? One of the things that I find really interesting is when I'm working with my clients and when I'm talking to my colleagues, I'm, I'm, I'm really tuned into the language that we use. And I hear a lot that when people talk about my business is small. And it got me thinking about, well, what does that create within us? What response does that create within us? And I almost sense this kind of a contraction. When somebody says I have a small business, it's like I have a small business, contract, and um, therefore your aspirations and your dreams and your ambitions contract a little too. And if you keep saying that to yourself over and over again, is it that you'll always have a small business? Now, you might be saying this to yourself in different guises. So, for example, I hear um, a lot of people talking about um, working part-time versus full-time in their business. So I only work part-time, I only work a couple of hours. Now, I know of people who have incredibly successful businesses, you know, making six-figure incomes or seven-figure incomes, um, and they only work a few hours a day. And so you've got to be thinking about, well, do you want to be working 35 to 40 hours a week? No? Okay, well then we don't need that construct. Um, you might be thinking to yourself, I don't have a team um, or I don't have premises and therefore I have a small business. And again, I know people who are, you know, really successful in their business and they work from home um, or they have um, a very small team, they have no team, they have a virtual team. So I think what's really important about this is reframing the language that we use. So instead of thinking that I have a small business because I don't have, um, I don't work full time or I don't have a team or I don't have premises, instead I would love for you to think about your business in terms of the impact and in terms of the reach of your business. So if you are, you know, working from home and you have um, a community of thousands of people and you're um, talking with them, you're adding value, you're helping them with their problems um, and you're providing solutions, then you're having an amazing impact and instead reframe how you think about your business in that uh, framework, in that uh, respect, from that perspective. So the next time you catch yourself saying to anybody that I have a small business, just catch yourself and go, hold on a minute, uh, I may, it may only just be me, I may be working from home, um, but I have a great reach um, and I'm helping people and I'm helping people that I don't even know that I'm helping, but isn't that amazing? So uh, I hope that's been of value to you. And you know, when you do find yourself kind of thinking small, then I would love for you just to think, OK, well, maybe I can just make it a little bit bigger. Maybe I can make my goals a little bit bigger and just kind of keep pushing and pushing and pushing because really the best gift that you can give to yourself is really living the biggest life that is possible for you and your loved ones. Um, and so we just need to be thinking about, well, how are we thinking about our lives and our business? And just kind of push a little bit more and push a little bit more. So I hope this uh, video has been of value to you and of use to you. And um, if you liked it, then please share it. Come on over to yasminvoraji.com where I'll be sharing with you more free content um, and you'll get updates um, about what's going on um, and in the world of Find Your Inner CEO. And I love to connect with you. So, you know, share your comments, um, share any aha moments that you've had. And I look forward to connecting with you the next time.